hi guys and welcome back to my channel that feels so amazing but so weird to say at the same time thank you so much for the positivity of my first video which you can see either here or here depending on where the card is so today we are doing a very different video from my get ready with me because I've obviously done my makeup off camera you're probably thinking why has she done this like what is she doing but today we are doing a Fenty cream blush review in the shade bikini martini which is why my eye look is the same as the blush shade I will do a video on this eye look if you want me to so comment down below if you would like to see that but anyway, going back to the main star of the show, which is Bikini Martini, the blush. I first went onto the Fenty Beauty website and I saw all the arm swatches and the shade that was screaming at me that looked so good on brown skin was the shade Bikini Martini. I rushed over to Boots and I purchased that one as soon as I could. It is worth £19 and you get three grams of product in that which I think is a bit steep, but if you want good makeup, Fenty Beauty is always the place to go. I just picked out one shade because I thought, well, if it doesn't look good on, on my skin tone, then why should I purchase another shade? So this video is for you and me both to see what the shade actually looks like on my skin tone. What it said on the packaging was it should give you a wash of colour, it should be sweat resistant, and it should be light as air. So let us see if it fits that criteria. It comes in this dinky packaging, which is similar to the Fenty Kilowatt highlighters. It's got the cream across it because it is obviously a cream product. So we are going to put the product on our face. I've done all my makeup, as I said previously. I just didn't put the blush on my face so let's get straight into putting the blush on on this side i am going to tap it on with my finger just to see how the product goes on just by using our fingers on the other side i'm going to be using my zoeva Lux sheer cheek brush but i know fenty beauty has brushes i just didn't purchase the cheek brush so as you see, it's like a vibrant pink colour, but it looks very bright in the pan, which is why I'm worried about what it will look like on the skin. Let's try it out. It feels really smooth so far. And this is what it looks like. And this is what it looks like on my hand. We are swirling our finger in again. And just, I think I'm just going to tap some off. And then we are going to put it on our face it is light on the skin and it does give a fresh wash of color it's a perfect pink shade even though it's very bright in the pan and just building it up as i go right i think i'm happy with that side but honestly it looks so good i think i'm gonna purchase another shade because there are 10 shades available in this cream cheeks out blush range and the 10 shades include a purple an orange a deep pink and the reds and pinks that you naturally associate blush shades with now we are going to do it with the blush brush we are going to tap the brush and look I think I'm going to blend it out with my finger. I'm just going to add a little bit more. It doesn't come off bright on the skin. It just gives a fresh wash of colour. It just blends effortlessly into the skin. This is a positive review from me and I will be getting as many shades of this as possible. To finish it off, we are going to place the lipstick on because it didn't feel right just putting blush on when all of my makeup was done. This is the shade, sorry, in Uncuffed, also by Fenty Beauty. 
so yeah that is my review on the Fenty cream blush shade in bikini martini you gotta try it out thank you for watching this video like comment and subscribe and make sure you follow my social media accounts they will be linked down below in the description bar click the bell so it turns blue and that means you'll get every single notification from me when i post a video and i hope you like this video I'll see you in my next one bye